वेलकम टू आवर चैनल नॉलेज ऑफ फ्रेंड्स सब्सक्राइब टू आवर चैनल एंड क्लिक द बेल आइकन फॉर द लेटेस्ट अपडेट टुडे वी गोना स्टार्ट विद योर क्वांटिटेटिव एप्टीट्यूड क्लास एंड दिस इज बीन द क्लासेस योर 74th क्लासेस ऑफ द सेशंस हियर हियर वी हैड डन योर 73rd क्लासेस इन द लास्ट सेशंस दैट वी हैव डिस्कस्ड अबाउट इट एंड इन द सेम केसेस इन क्वांटिटेटिव एप्टीट्यूड वी हैड स्टार्टेड विद अरिथमेटिकल एबिलिटी in arithmetical ability we had uh, you know uh, uh, done many of uh, the topics that we have done is your operations on numbers the same and same of numbers decimal fraction simplification square roots and cube roots problems on numbers sums and ages sums and indices and uh, now we are dealing with the topic that is being the percentage here so in same case for the percentage that we have to deal here in percentage even though we had reached uh, more than uh, 155 questions we had done already and today we'll have to start discussing about 155th uh, question of the session that is being the important one and that is also being important uh, for us as well to solve it out because uh, these all are important questions here so on the same cases uh, we go ahead and that was we have to talk about it we go ahead to question of the session first and before starting with this it's a huge request to all the viewers to please go through with the subscribe button and please like share and subscribe our channel so that many and maximum people can get the information at once and everything you can also enjoy the video as well in quantitative aptitude the question of the session is uh, we have that rohit spends 40% of his salary on food 20% on house rent 10% on entertainment and 10% on convenient uh, conveyance if his uh, saving at the end of the month uh, are of uh, 50 rupees 1500 then his monthly salary is this has been asked in your ssc examination paper which has been important one as well and that the options we have is your uh, 6000 7500 8000 and 10000 as well so here we go ahead 155th question of the session so question is rohit spends 40% of his salary on food 20% on house rent 10% on entertainment and 10% on convenience so if his saving at the end of a month are rupees 1500 then his monthly salary is this is been asked in ssc examination paper which is been important one as well and let's go ahead for the solution here and that we have as follows so here we go ahead so the solution for the same is saving we'll talk about it so that has been the savings is equals to 100 minus 40 plus 20 plus 10 plus 10 percent which is been equals to 20% because it will be 40 plus 20 is your 60 plus 70 plus 80 so 80 100 minus 80 of course it is 20% so let the monthly salary be rupees x let the monthly salary be rupees x that is for the same then 20% of x equals to 1500 so 20 upon 100 x equals to 1500 x equals to 1500 into 5 which is 15 fives so as your 7500 so that mean there uh, will be the right answer for this question as well 
we'll go ahead so the next and that what we have to talk about it which has been the important one as well is the another important question is 156th question of the session here the question we have here that Kunal spent rupees 35,000 in buying raw materials, rupees 40,000 in buying machinery and 20% of the total amount he had as cash with him. What was the total amount that options we have here is rupees 80,000, rupees 85,700, uh, 90,000 and 93,750. So we'll go ahead for the same here and that is we have to talk about it that has been the 156th question of the session so we'll go ahead for the same you can write it down all the questions that we are dealing here and you can make it out solution for the same and you will do by your side you will get to know about it that are you able to do it or not so now i'll spend 35,000 in buying raw materials Rupees forty thousand. That is rupees forty thousand in buying machinery and ten and uh, that is uh, raw material and forty thousand in buying machinery and. Uh, machine 20 percent uh, machine machinery and 20 percent of the total amount he had as cash with him what was the total amount what was the total amount that we have option is 80,000, 85,000, 750, 90,000, 93,750 here so we'll go ahead for the same and we'll find it out for here let the total amount be rupees x let the total amount be rupees x then uh, it will be your then then that has been uh, rupees x then 100 minus 20 percent of x is equal to 1500 into 5 which is equals to uh, that has been uh, 20% uh, that has been uh, sorry that equals to 35,000 plus 40,000 so 80% of x equals to 75,000 and so 80 upon 100 x equals to 75,000 then x equals to 75,000 into 5 upon 4 equals to 93,750 that we have as an answer of course and that's what we have to talk about it let's go ahead for the next we'll talk about it which has been 157th question of the sessions here which has been also an important one um, that has been the 157th of the question here and that will go ahead 157th question of the session the question has been Gaurav spends 30% of his monthly income on food articles 40% of the remaining on a conveyance and a cloths and saves a 50% of the remaining if the his monthly salary is rupees 18,400 how much money does he save uh, every month options we have here that we have is um, 3,624, 3,864, 4,264 and rupees of 5,888 as well. So we'll go ahead for the same here. So Gaurav spends 30% of his monthly income 
on food articles 40% of the remaining on convents and cloths and saves fifty percent of the remaining if his monthly salary is rupees eighteen thousand four hundred how much how much money does he save every month the question is options i told you 3624 3864 and then we have your uh, 4264 and 5888 as well so we'll go ahead for the same and that we talk about it now we'll go ahead for the saving here saving equals to 50 percent or 100 minus 40 percent of 100 minus 30 percent of rupees 18,400 so rupees 50 upon 100 into 60 upon 100 into 70 upon 100 in the same cases it is being on the 70% upon 100 into 18,400 which is equal to rupees 3,864 it will be cancelled by this then it will be cancelled by this these two zeros being cancelled by this so one zero is remaining in that two uh, that will cancel here two fives are ten and two uh, a nine is a eighteen and two to the four five ones are five five ones are five cancel it out so seven six uh, uh, that is being forty two and plus nine and then multiply ninety two three thousand eight hundred and sixty four will get as an answer we'll go ahead with the next question we talk about it which has been the another important question here and that has been uh, the answer we have here and in which we have to talk about it has been the question is 158 question of the session here the question being a spider climbed 62 1 by 2 uh, percent of the height of the pole in one hour and in the next hour it covered 12 1 by 2 percent of the remaining height if the uh, height of the pole is 192 meter then distance climbed in second hour is this has been asked in section of this question paper and that has been the important one as well so we have to talk about it so the options we have three meter five meter seven meter and nine meter we'll go ahead for the same a spider climbed 62 1 by 2 percent of the height of the pole in one hour and in the next hour it covered 12 1 by 2 percent so here for the same that we have a 12 1 by 2 percent and of the remaining height if the height of the pole is 192 meter then 
and distance to climb in second hour is this has been asked section officers examination paper as well so the options we have three meter uh, five meter seven meter and nine meter we have and for the same then go ahead for the same yeah. height climbed in second hour equals to 12 1 by 2 percent of 100 minus 62 1 by 2 percent of 192 that will be as 25.2 into 1 upon 100 into 75.2 into 1 upon 100 into 192 meter you we'll cancel it out here 25 ones are 25 25 fours are 100 then it will be 2 twos are 4 2 oh nines are 18 into 6 are 12 then again 2 ones are 2 2 threes are uh, 2 oh threes are 6 2 seven, two fours are 8 and 2 eights are 16 then 2 ones are 2 2 uh, uh, that is your uh, we have here that is uh, 2 4 is 8 and uh, 2 8 is 16 is 48 so 2 1 is 2 2 2 is 4 2 4 is 8 then we have a 2 1 is 2 2 1 is 2 2 2 is 12 okay then we have 75 into 12 in upon uh, that is you we have your 100 here mm, that is being uh, when we further cancel it out and it will uh, give as an answer as being the 9 meter so 9 meter will be the right answer for this question as well we'll go ahead for the next and we'll find it out for sure that has been the another important question and that has been the 159th question of the sessions here which is being important one let's go ahead for the same as being 159th question of the session the question has been a man spends 35 percent of his income on food 25 percent on children education and 80 percent of the remaining on house rent what percent of his income is he is left with option is 8 percent 10 percent 12 percent and 14 percent so we'll go ahead for the same here and that is the a man spends 35 percent of his income on food 25% on children's education and 80% of the and 80% of the remaining on house rent what percent of his income what percent of his income he is left with so we'll go ahead for the solution here that is also been important one so here we go ahead we'll go ahead for the same for the 159 question solution we have so that is let the total income be x let the total income be x then income left equals to 100 minus 80 percent of 100 minus 35 plus 25 percent of x that is equals to 20 percent of 40 percent of x which is equals to here is 20 upon 100 
into 40 upon 100 into 100 percent of x that is equals to 8 percent of x that we have answer here we we'll go ahead with another question that has been the important one and that is the 160th question of the session as well and that even though we have to go ahead for the same question is from the salary of an officer 10% is dedu uh, deducted as house rent 20% of the rest he spends on convince and 20% uh, on the rest he pays as income tax and 10% of the balance he spends on cloths and then he left with rupees 15,552 so find the total salary of that person here we'll go ahead for the same and that what we have to talk about it let's go ahead for the same and hopefully this will be the last question of the session as well so here we go ahead and for the same yeah, that we have to talk about it which has been of course important one so here that the question we we'll write it down here this has been the question has been asked of course uh, then uh, which is the options we have 25,000, 30,000, 35,000 and 40,000 this has been asked in LIC AO examination paper and that has been the important one as well so we'll go ahead for the same so from the salary from the salary of an officer 10% is deducted as house rent 20% of the rest he spent on convince 20% of the rest he pays as income tax the same cases we go ahead for the same and that even we have to talk about it so here that he uh, you know the rest he pays on income tax here and uh, after that and 10 percent of uh, the balance of the balance he spends on cloths So then, he is left with rupees 15,552. Find the total salary. Okay, that we have here. So on the same cases, uh, this has been question has been asked in uh, LIC uh, AAO examination paper which has been of course important options we have 35,000, 30,000, 35,000 and 40,000 as well so here we go ahead for the solution and for that uh, we have to talk about it let's go ahead for the same uh, so here we go ahead for uh, the same that has been the 160th solution let the total in the salary be rupees x let the total salary be rupees x then 100 minus 10 percent of 100 minus 20 percent of 100 minus 20 percent uh, that is being 100 minus 20 percent and 100 minus 10 of 100 minus 10 percent of x equals to 15,552 open it out 90 upon 100 into 80 upon 100 into 80 upon 100 into 90 upon 100 into x is equals to 15,552 equals to x equals to 15,552 okay I just write it down here x equals to 15,552 
into 10,000 upon 64 into 81 and that has been equals to 3 so 30,000 we have now we'll go ahead for the next we'll talk about it which has been another important question here and that has been of course the last one that as I told you here we'll go ahead for the same that has been representing the 161th question of the session the question here is Aman gave 40% of the amount, amount he had to Rohan Rohan in a turn gave one fourth of what he received from Aman to Sahil after paying rupees 100 to the taxi driver out of the amount he got from Rohan Sahil now has rupees 600 left with him how many amount did Aman have this has been question has been asked in bank view question paper that has been important of course and that what we have to answer it out as well and that has been the important one option is rupees 4000 8000 12000 data inadequate let's go ahead for the same Aman gave 40 percent of the amount he had to Rohan Rohan in return in turn gave one fourth of what he received from Aman to Sahil after paying rupees 200 to the taxi driver out of the amount he got From Rohan Sahil now has rupees 600 left with a him how much amount did Aman have how much amount did Aman have this has been the question here and this has been asked in your bank for your question paper as well so we'll go ahead for the solution here as well here right now so with this let the amount be uh, would Aman be rupees x let the amount with Aman be rupees x then amount received by Sahil equals to 1 upon 4 of 40 percent of rupees X equals to 10 percent of rupees X then 10 percent of x 10 percent of x equals to 600 plus 20 200 it will be equals to 10 upon 100 x equals to 800 x equals to 800 into 10 which is equals to 8000 that we have as an answer here as well so here we're gonna end up with it's a huge request to all the viewers to please go through with the subscribe button and please like share and subscribe our channel so that many and maximum people can get the information at once and even you can also enjoy the video as well and that has been the important one other than quantitative aptitude if i'm talking about yes we had done your sociology and software engineering we had done your chemistry where in that we had done your unit uh, in that unit one unit two unit three unit four unit five unit six unit seven unit eight unit nine 
as well as the conversions, regressions, antilogs, and uh, elements with their symbols, atomic mass, and the molar masses, of course. After talking about that, we had done uh, your understanding the human being comprehensively, the human aspiration and its fulfillment as well. And we have we had done unit one, unit two, unit three, unit four, unit five with their two marks possible question. We had done your ER diagrams, which is really important, of course. And other than that, as well, we talk about we had done your reasoning. We have we had done your verbal reasoning in that we had done general mental abilities, logic reasoning, and non verbal reasoning. We had done your series analogy, classification, analytical reasoning, mirror image, water image, embedded figure completions of incomplete pattern, figure matrix, paper folding, paper cutting, goal direction, grouping of identical figures, cubes and dice, dot situation, problems on numbers, problems on ages, starts and indices, and percentage we are dealing here as well. And in terms of, uh, you know, uh, we are talking about uh, uh, the reference towards the reasoning here. Yes, of course, uh, we had done your uh, series and logic classification, analytical reasoning, mirror image, water image, embedded figure completions of incomplete pattern, figure matrix, paper folding, paper cutting, rule detection, grouping of identical figures, cubes and dice, draw situation, constructions of squares and triangles, figure formation and analysis, and practice questions that, that we are dealing with here. After talking about quantitative aptitude, this has been divided into two sections, which has been the arithmetical ability and the data interpretation. In arithmetical ability, we had done your op number operations on numbers, as if an LCM of number, decimal fraction, simplification, square roots and cube roots, averages, problems on numbers, problems on ages, starts and indices, percentage, profit, loss, ratio and proportion, partnership, chain rule, time and work, pipe and system, time and distance, problems on trains, boards and streams, allegations or mixtures, simple interest, compound interest, uh, compound interest logarithm, area. Volume and surface area, races and games of skills, calendar, clock, stock, ratios, permutation and combination, probability, to discount, anchor, discount, height and distance, on and on series. In data interpretation, we have to cover up the tabulation, bar graphs, pie charts, and line graphs as well. And we are dealing with the CB and of course, that has been the important one, important subject here. So thank you. Hope you enjoy this video. If you like this video, please give a thumbs up and give a suggestion on the comment box. Please like, share and subscribe our channel so that many maximum people can get the information at once. And even though you can also enjoy the video as well. So thank you. Hope you enjoy this video. If you like this video, please give a thumbs up and give a suggestion in the comment box. Thank you.